My name is Willie Miner, and I'm a volunteer fireman. That's my life, just saving people. And I can never end that. I was coming in from work, and I was two minutes away from home, ramped over a big embankment, and nose to tail on the road. Spinal cord injuries, C3, 4, and 5. We were told that he would be a quadriplegic the rest of his life. I could never lift my arms, never move my fingers, couldn't move my legs on command, and I couldn't even turn my neck so far. We were told at the beginning it was a marathon, not a sprint. When he got here, they made a structured program around what he needed. The therapists who are working with Willie are all very motivated and have specific training in teenagers. They maintain constant communication among themselves and also with me. The patients themselves can have support from each other. Me being a physical example was something Willie needed. And if I can do it, I want to help others to do it. That's one thing I got taught by Sharif, never say never. To bring a child with special needs here to this institution assures the family that we will coordinate their care to garner the necessary strength and sensory input to muscles that may not be working or have been damaged and to maximize that effort in the short term as well as the long term. We use therapies to help his arms get stronger. We gradually get the patients more and more upright. We're trying to work on things like endurance. First, we call it going through the motions, but it is giving the body the movement that we hope the body then will come to develop on its own. You are sitting all by yourself, Willie. Bam. Woo! Right. The therapists, they're pretty cool. They know everything. They don't let you take breaks. You get right into it. Never say no to them. These nurses, therapists, phenomenal. He has made great strides. And I believe this is where it starts at the Children's Institute. It's a miracle. I can do basically anything, but just can't get up out of the wheelchair yet. My goal is to be up and walking. I don't care if it takes a couple years or a couple months. I have faith I'll be back in and getting the fire nozzle going into a burning building.